A Georgia faith leader representing more than 530 churches is calling upon Governor Brian Kemp to publicly oppose Republican efforts to remove or discipline Fulton County District Attorney Fonnie Willis. Willis, a Democrat and the first black woman to serve in the position, has become a lightning rod for attacks by supporters of former President Donald Trump, who she indicted this month along with 18 others on charges related to an alleged conspiracy to overturn the results of the 2020 presidential election. Many state and national GOP lawmakers, not to mention Trump himself, have criticized Willis as a partisan hack and have proposed launching investigations and pursuing sanctions against her over the case, which marks the fourth indictment against the former president amid his bid to return to the White House. We strongly call upon you to make it publicly known that you do not support the calls of those who seek an investigation of Willis, Bishop Reginald T. A. Jackson, head of the African Methodist Episcopal Church in Georgia, wrote in a letter sent Friday. The letter, obtained exclusively by USA Today, comes at a time when Republican governors are cracking down on liberal-leaning prosecutors and it cites a state law signed by Kemp this year creating a new panel, dubbed the Prosecuting Attorneys Qualifications Commission, that can discipline, remove or apply measures against prosecutors who are not following the law. Georgia Republicans pitched the change as an oversight policy which Kemp celebrated in May as a way to hold rogue or incompetent prosecutors accountable. The governor's office did not immediately respond to a request for comment. A statement from Kemp would put to rest this divisive, polarizing, partisan and inflammatory attempt to disrupt our state and its people, according to Jackson, who notes how Kemp testified to the grand jury in the case and has rejected Trump's false claims that the presidential contest was stolen in previous public comments.